Authority Local Forecast. Welcome back into Sunrise 7, 14, excuse me, is your time this morning here on a Thursday. And we're going to take a look now outside at our RV World Yuma Sky Cam to see what's in store for today and the rest of the week as Melissa joins us in studio to let us know what to expect. This comes off after some a little bit of sprinkles yesterday. It's an interesting day. Yeah, we did feel some sprinkles yesterday and had some clouds in our sky. So tracking that still for today and even the rest of the week. So looking outside on our RV World Yuma Skycam this morning, a little dark out there, but we'll continue to see some cloud coverage, a little bit of light winds, but that monsoonal moisture is just really here to stay within our region. So it's keeping us warm and humid with our conditions. So looking at our current temperatures as of right now, we're thankfully still staying in the double digits, but we're starting to warm up just a little bit. So starting to see those temperatures rise in the upper 80s and starting to go into the 90s. So it's only going to get a little warmer as we continue with our afternoon, but thankfully we're staying below normal with our temperatures, but it won't feel all that much cooler because we have that monsoonal moisture keeping us humid. And here's a look at our satellite and radar. So we're seeing some storm activity off to the east of us near Phoenix and Flagstaff area, but taking a closer look right here in our area, we're starting to see more of the activity coming from the east and going into our area. So we can expect to see some scattered showers and some sprinkles here and there. So keep that in mind if you are going to be out and about this morning. And I'm still going to be tracking um, these mild temperatures over the next several days with those partly cloudy skies. However, we are going to increase in more moisture as we go into tomorrow, which that'll bring us some greater rain chances that we'll experience for tomorrow and even going into our weekend. So definitely be prepared for that. And looking at our future dew points, we're going to stay warm, but also pretty sticky out there. So we'll see our dew points continuing to stay in the 60s. So a lot higher than we would like them to be. We definitely like much drier conditions. So we will still be pretty humid over the next several days as that monsoonal moisture is just staying put here in the desert southwest. But here's what I'm tracking. So possibly we'll see some future rain. So here's a look at a little bit of tiny precipitation that'll start rolling in as early as tomorrow morning. So we can see some light showers and sprinkles as we start off our Friday and then even going into our weekend. We still have that greater chance to experience some of these some of this activity. And we have all the ingredients for the clouds, warm conditions, and also plenty of moisture. So we have that potential for these storms to develop. So keeping a close eye on that, but we do have a 10 to 30% chance of rain over the next several days. Now looking at our air quality index presented by Imperial County Air Pollution Control District. There has been no changes, still looking pretty good overall, just have moderate conditions for Mexicali. But with our winds staying nice and light, it's keeping us pretty great with our air quality. Now looking at our eight day forecast sponsored by Polar Cooling, look at those temperatures staying pretty cool or at least cooler than normals. But again, we're not able to enjoy it as much due to the increase in monsoonal moisture and those greater chances for some rain showers. So just be on the lookout for that. Back to you, Chelsea and Cole.